The DNA Technology Regulation Bill was introduced in the Lok Sabha in July 2019. The bill was then referred to the Parliamentary Standing Committee on Science and Technology. The committee recently in a draft report pointed out that some of the provisions in the bill could be misused in different ways. DNA Technology Regulation Bill also known as DNA Profiling Bill seeks to control the use of DNA technology for establishing the identity of a person especially to identify missing persons victims offenders under trials and unknown deceased persons The DNA Technology Bill also seeks to establish a national data bank and regional DNA data banks As per the bill The criteria for entry, retention or removal of the DNA profile will be specified by regulations. The bill provides for the establishment of a DNA regulatory board which will supervise the DNA data banks and DNA laboratories. The bill also gives the assurance that the DNA test results will be reliable. It ensures that the DNA remains protected from the misuse or abuse in terms of the privacy rights of citizens. The bill proposes a written consent by individuals before the collection of their DNA samples. While the bill allows for the use of DNA profiling in criminal investigations, it also allows the use of this technology for certain civil matters such as surrogacy, maternity or paternity check. organ transplantation and immigration The standing committee pointed out that the DNA profiles can reveal extremely sensitive information of an individual and hence could be misused for caste or community based profiling There are criticisms that the DNA profiling bill is the violation of human rights as it could also compromise with the privacy of the individuals Also, questions are being raised on how the bill plans to safeguard the privacy of DNA profiles stored in the data banks.